gonna be way better when I edit this and my boobs aren't in it, probably. If you clicked on this video, you are one of two, two things. You are either A, a teen, preteen, or in your early 20s and you know what visco is and you're like, what the fuck, bitch, because you ain't it, sis. Or you're in your 30s to 50s and beyond and you're like, huh, what? And I'm here to let you know that I have been visco since before visco was cool okay okay so since before all y'all started talking visco girl and I, ooh, I can't even do it I've been rocking the visco lifestyle for a long time and I'd like to point out though um, just for anybody wondering that at this point I don't even have a visco account I haven't even downloaded the app but that's just how visco I am. I'm so visco, like I don't even know I'm visco. Um, so for those of you who don't know, VSCO, or visco, is a photo editing app where I believe you can also follow people, as far as I understand, because like, even though I'm visco, I'm still like an old lady that doesn't know anything. But, my understanding is to be a visco girl you have to somewhat fit the aesthetic of this app and fall into certain categories and when I was reading up on it and looking into it and watching videos I was like didn't I do this in the 90s haven't I been here done that let me explain but first I better get myself visco fied so don't go anywhere. Now a couple things, there are a couple ways in which I can never and will never fit the visco lifestyle. Uh, this is about as oversized as my shirts <coughs> get because your girl's fat, okay? Um, there's no oversized here and even if there were, I can't wear it in such a way where it would look like I have no pants on because that's just not allowed. Um, it's not pretty, it's not nice, and I don't wanna get arrested. I have to look like I have pants on at all times, like never nudes, like I need to always have pants. So that's another way in which just can't fit the aesthetic. But you think you're all original with your scrunchies and wearing them on your wrist, like bitch, we knew scrunchies were cool, like, way back. Before you were born, puka shells have come and gone several times. And because I love to not give up on a trend, I just hung on to mine. This messy bun, like, this is not, oh, yeah, mess it up even more. Because that's how you know. But like, y'all are just getting yourselves really ready for like, mom life, I think. Um, I do not have a hydro flask, but I do have a Contigo water bottle because this goes everywhere with me. And there's a, like a time of life where like this wasn't really a thing and hydro flasks weren't really a thing. But you know what was a thing? Drinking from the water fountain. Just like tap water, just like out in the world. But while I was preparing myself to be a visco girl or to show you all how I am, the OG Visco girl because like this is my look through all of the 90s and 2000s. I'm confused why you think this is new. Oh my god, there's like a flying grasshopper on my window. But what else? You do you. And a oop. And a oop. But what I realized I didn't have was a nice long stretch of friendship bracelets. But you know what I do have, friends? is working knowledge of how to make said friendship bracelet. So don't you fret. Um, if you did not do this on your summer vacation, like I don't understand your life. If your life in 1995 was not rocking this look while making this bracelet by tying things together and safety pinning it to your pants, 
then I don't understand your life, okay? I just don't get it. So what I want to do now is get my thumbnail. Okay, it's good enough. And guys, I gotta do this quick too because like I got kids to pick up from school, okay? So like, you think like I might be lacking a few elements and I, oop. But uh, I, got, I got shit to do. And I'm not going to Starbucks. Like we're not about that life. I just don't want you to think that you're original. Like there's a reason we wore scrunchies. There is a reason we made friendship bracelets. And there is a reason we had environmental club and wore big t-shirts. I don't know what all the reasons are, to be honest with you, but the reason for some of it is that like, we didn't have anything fucking else to do. So it's good to know that we've come full circle and y'all don't have anything to do either. But like, get your own trends, you know? So then you put your safety pin through your knot and stick your leg out and pin it to your pants. I'm gonna change the camera angle now so that y'all can watch the magic, okay? So, the way we do this is we start with one color. I'm gonna start with the sort of brownish gold. Keep the other colors all together. We make the number four. Can you see that? Boom, boom, boom. And then we loop it through, pull it all the way through, and pull it up. And we're just gonna continue this. Oh my God, all you can see is how fat I am. This is fantastic. Whoops. And then, oop. You wanna, whoops. You wanna hold tight on your group of them. Oh my gosh, you guys, I almost showed you my foot without payment. Okay, so I'm not keeping track of the number of knots because I can't even keep track of the number of kids I have. Let's have a look. What winds up happening, if it'll focus on it, is this really nice little twist of the knots. So I will check back with you after I do a little bit more and we can see how real Visco girls do it. Brand new day, same stupid hair. But I did finish my friendship bracelet. Um, it's a little big for me. That's what she said. But uh, yeah, basically nailed it, okay? So Visco, Visco AF. I'm not really sure, somewhere along the line I lost the point of this video, but, um, content. So, there you go. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. This has been Jossie Potts saying, love you all.